Anne writes to me, Warren, is it possible to remove dog tartar naturally? If so, how? I just went through this with my guys, Molly and Willie. The answer is yes, and the answer is no. There are so many things you can do. For example, I give Molly and Willie crisp vegetables and fruits to chew on. Helps remove some of the tartar. Molly does not like having her teeth brushed, so I use wipes on Molly. However, if you can get your dog to accept the toothbrush and you do it gradually till the dog actually looks forward to it and use only doggy toothpaste, that's critical. A lot of people say, well, I'm just going to use my toothpaste. Remember, we spit and gargle. Unless you're teaching your dog to spit and gargle, human toothpaste is no good. It's caustic. It contains detergent. So there's specific toothpaste with flavors made for your dog or cat. So brushing is really important. There are also little rubber tips you can put on your finger to get rid of a lot of the tartar as well. However, here's the bottom line. I definitely recommend brushing. I definitely recommend those finger things and wiping. There's a product on the market I use, and this is not a pro, it's not to do with me. I use a product called Aurovet. I give Molly and Willie one of these to chew on every day. Now, here's what it does. It prevents bacterial attachment, reduces uh, plaque, halitosis. So there are other products. This is just one, Aurovet, just one, but there are other products on the market as well that will help eliminate them. All that being said, let me explain a couple of things to you. I've been doing this for a few weeks and I've been helping you guys for a few weeks. And I always hear about bad breath and teeth falling out and rotten teeth. If your dog is healthy, if your dog is able to be anesthetized by your vet, perhaps, perhaps it's that time. My dogs, Molly and Willie, you know I adopted them from a high kill shelter. I clean their teeth as well as anyone can clean their teeth. However, that being said, Molly and Willie, because they were confined and abused, are, are groomers. They like to groom each other and themselves. So they're constantly licking. What does that mean? That means they're getting hair, dander underneath their gums, where even with a toothbrush, you may not be able to reach. Now, there are people out there that do non-anesthetic teeth cleaning. I think that's great. However, every once in a while, depending on the severity of the condition of your dog's teeth and gums, and by the way, uh, 85 to 90 percent of dogs and cats will develop some type of dental or periodontal disease by the time they're three or four years old. So crispy fruit and vegetables, pick up a doggy brush if your dog will let you do that. If not, you can get the wipes. Some of them have uh, uh, stuff on it to help. Uh, you can use products like Aurovet to help them chew. Uh, all of these things can make a big, big difference. However, that being said, it's really important that you can have the, the non-anesthetic uh, vets, uh, non-anesthetic procedures as well. Every once in a while, though, if your dog is healthy enough, and you know, your vet's going to do a blood test, obviously, it may really need that, your, need that your dog needs to have their teeth professionally cleaned. Well, they use a Cavitron, the same thing they use on my teeth or your teeth, a Cavitron to clean the teeth, get underneath those gums really, really well. Because, uh, you know, bad teeth, people think, well, it's bad breath. It doesn't mean anything. Well, gum disease can develop into a lot more bacterial infections that can go throughout the whole body and ultimately make your dog and your cats pretty darn sick. So keeping the teeth clean is important. Dry food is also good. It helps clean the teeth as well. Dry with whatever you want to do. But remember, it's important to keep those teeth clean because they can develop disease at time. And good luck to you. Ed. Once the teeth are clean and the breath is back to where it should be, give that pup a big hug and a kiss. I'll more next night.